Richard, it's, it's a long, long season this this year, especially. How important is it to have an opportunity to feel refreshed at this time? Yeah, obviously, it's one of the <coughs> uh, real plus points of being at this club that um, not only do they give you breaks, but they give you a bit of advance warning of when they're going to be. So, plan a few things. So, um, nice few days away and uh, refreshed and ready to get stuck in. Over those two weeks, um, the squad has has kept the winning one run going. We've seen Ben Spencer, especially in your position, uh, playing playing fantastically well. Um, is it pleasing to see such strength and depth? Yeah, I think I think we know it's there all the time. We um, <coughs> we train against each other constantly, and it's the standards are really high. So we we know we've got a good squad, um, and the coaches do a great job of managing us and, and using it. And um, hopefully, we're going to this weekend in good form, but uh, in good spirits with everyone getting some good game time and sort of carrying on that winning run. Does it keep you on your toes? Yeah, I think I'm always on my toes anyway because I, I say I know uh, I know how good they are in training and stuff and um, but yeah I, I push myself rather than anyone else doing it for me so um, I'll be as good as I can be and if that's good enough to get in the team then happy days. You're an experienced European campaigner um, but, but what is it like going to teams that, that maybe don't have so much experience playing against uh, such as the this weekend? Does that change preparations? Uh, a little bit, because we're going to have to do a little bit more homework on them than uh, you would do in a Premiership week. Um, the signs around of all the players and, um, and their squad all around, so we can get used to who we're playing against. But um, from our point of view, training-wise, it won't change too much. It'll um, just be a little bit more uh, video work and a little bit more studying to see who we're playing. It's a double header against Oyanat. Tactically, can it be difficult to play teams twice in a row? Um, I don't know. It's, you know, if you get things wrong the first week, you can always um, sort them out. But if you get them right, then obviously they'll come with a plan to do that. So hopefully it's the latter and uh, we get things right the weekend and uh, give them something to think about for the week after. You see teams like Oyanat really step up their game for the Champions Cup. Uh, how important is it not to underestimate, uh, underestimate them despite their league form? And how important is it to, to get off to a good start this weekend? We're going to have to start, well we know it's going to be a massive game for them, their first game in the top European uh, Cup, their first one at home, sorry, um, so we know they're going to be right up for it and, uh, and we're going to have to be at our best to, to try and take the points away in France, whenever you play away in France it's nothing but tough, um, it's going to be cold and those things there but luckily they've got a, a beautiful plastic pitch like us.